Just when you thought there was a lot of traffic in the halls and stairways, we now have another place to worry about the traffic, and that is on Mission Boulevard. We went around Moreau to see how the students and faculty feel about the construction. I hate Mission Boulevard. I always have to leave my house at 7.05 just to get here so I can have a parking spot. It used to be that I could leave at like 7.15 and I'd still get a parking spot, but now I have to leave super early just so I won't have to park by the cows. And then every single time after practice, I have to sit through like 30 minutes of traffic just to go home and I'm just trying to eat and I hate it. It's annoying and I can't get to school any other way but Mission because otherwise it'll just be a big circle and that's just a lot of gas. I sat on Mission Boulevard from 7.45 until 8.30 waiting to get to school because the stupid traffic was not moving. But on the bright side, I did get to listen to my entire Nicki Minaj CD, Pink Friday. Students aren't the only ones trying to avoid the traffic on mission. The faculty and staff feel your same pain. When I'm driving, making a left from harder, and I'm stuck for 20 minutes on a two block stretch. So I agonize right there with you. Um, and then, for example, uh, this morning for me, Jefferson was only going every other light. So that was a huge backup as well, where you try and be smart and make a right and come around. So I think what's been interesting about this entire process is as the city is doing the work and the construction company, we don't always get notified about what those changes are going to be, when that's going to happen, and then all of a sudden we show up to make a left-hand turn and the light doesn't work. So in situations where there's a, an anomaly or something that we couldn't control, we didn't know about, something where the light's not turning or it's not emptying the turn pocket, then we have tried to be lenient. Although they have made improvements such as extending the left-hand turning lane in front of Moreau, we will be dealing with this construction until the end of 2012. So I think it's just a challenge that we're all trying to live with. I think the best plan of action for anyone is to plan ahead, leave early, allow those extra 15 minutes, and just hang out in the student center. This is Marcus Mediola and Anthony Hamilton signing out from MCTV.